You hear that? That's the awkward silence of a family dinner after you just got caught vaping. Most vapes contain high levels of nicotine and disappointment. <sighs> Brought to you by The Real Cost and the FDA. All right, what's up, guys? Welcome to another episode of the T-Moz Boss Show. And in today's episode, dang, man, this is the final episode of season 99, fam. Like, it's honestly, it's crazy to think, like, I've been doing it for this long. And the fact that, like, next episode is going to be the first episode of the 100th season. I'm like, bro, I got to go all out. I got to go all out for that episode. So I'm, I'm going to be, I'm going to probably, like, think of some stuff to uh, do to, like, make it a major and big episode. In fact, I'm actually going to post on social media. I I think, well, no, nah, let me... I think I need to, like, go ahead and do it right now. But actually, in this episode, I'll be talking on, like, my experience uh, having a gaming PC. For those that don't know, I purchased a gaming PC um, a while back. And, man, <laughs> it has been... So, I'm going to get into it. I'm going to get into it and stuff. But, now nah, let me post real quick on social media... Um, all right, for my 100th season, I honestly don't even know what I want to post on social media. You know what? Nah, let's just squash all that. I, I, I'll think of something because right now, so I'm trying to think of what I'm going to say for this episode and then think what I'm trying to say. So it's multitasking. I'm not good at that. So anyways, uh, moving on. But no, I wanted to talk on my experience uh, having a gaming PC. So actually, I've had uh, a couple of gaming PCs. And this one that I recently picked up is like a top tier like gaming PC. So I had bought um a gaming pc off of my friend i think i've mentioned my friend before the one that's um he's half white and i'm um, half guamanian uh but no he uh so he had a gaming pc but he was like he was done with it and he won't use it no more so he sold it to me i used it for a little bit and then um yeah after that i just stopped and ended up getting another gaming pc because it had like it had like all these like fancy lights and all that stuff on anything so i was like you know what let me go ahead and get that real quick. But the thing was is that it was one of them like low end uh type gaming PCs. I I didn't even spend over a thousand dollars for it. I think it was like eight hundred, something like that. So yeah, it wasn't like a top tier gaming PC, but it did help with me doing reaction videos. But eventually that has started getting old. So I was like, okay, I got it. You know, I stopped using that and then eventually just went to using um laptops. And then, uh, yeah, ended up getting a gaming laptop. It was uh, an Acer laptop. Yeah, it was an Acer gaming laptop. And so, yeah, I was like, I was using that for a little bit. I remember I bought the video game, The Division, off, um, for that laptop. And I never played it. I played it like one time. And I have to say, like, with this current gaming PC that I have, I played so I played a lot more of The Division that I have before on PC and stuff. And I'm like, versus like, oh, versus Xbox. I'm like, yeah, I know people are like, wait a minute, what about Xbox? Like, no pc wise i'm like i bought this game around the time when it came out um and yeah just now uh playing it on pc and things and so yeah i was like i don't know why i did that but um uh, i guess like you know because no i was like there's i'm gonna get into the game and stuff i'm gonna get into the video games and stuff but anyways um so yeah i had that gaming laptop for like a year then it started getting old so then eventually i had to go and uh get me yeah and then, um so in the beginning of the pandemic i had to go and get me another laptop so i had got this one touchscreen gaming laptop that wasn't good gave that to some friends and then i ended up getting my current uh gaming laptop this msi one that this gaming laptop is solid and i like it a lot and it can run a lot of different video games it actually it's a pretty solid uh um gaming laptop i was like it can actually play a lot of different video games surprisingly so but the thing is is that it gets hot like and so i'm like i really don't want to mess this one up because i do also use it for making reaction videos and other videos and, and i'm like i ain't trying to mess this up so i don't want to like overly use it and things you know i just kind of want to save it and stuff but and then uh recently i had got me a gaming pc now my experience with it so far 
it's solid i like it but there are some upgrades that um i had to do to it and that i still have to do to it and stuff so yeah it's definitely going to uh it ain't gonna be cheap <laughs> it is not gonna be cheap having this game in pc i'll tell you that much right now so anyways um so actually i was actually gonna get another gaming um pc but it has sold out and it was probably good that i didn't get that one because it didn't have a whole lot of memory and i know if i had to go and get that one I had to go out and get me some uh, memory um, cards to go with it. And I'm like, I ain't really trying to do all that. You know, if I do decide to get one, it's going to probably be like far down the road and things. And so I'm like, I really don't want to, you know, get into that right now. So anyways, um, ended up uh, that. And so actually, funny thing is that um, computer has sold out. So I was, it, they said it had like one left in the store. And I was like, dang, right when I was going to get it, right when I was going to order it and stuff. Because no, that's what it was. So I was all like, man, should I order it? I'm like, nah, I shouldn't order it. But I'm like, I really want to order it. Nah, I shouldn't. By the time I, by the time I came up with a conclusion, I'm like, yes, I need to order it. Gone. So then I ended up uh, getting um, this other one by CyberPower um, PC. Yeah, it's, uh, yeah, it's by CyberPower pc and stuff because no that's what i had bought uh before that was the the one that was like i that I bought after my uh um friend when he gave me his and stuff i was like nah let me go ahead and get this cyber power pc and so yeah i was like i like cyber power pcs you know they're solid i like them so anyways got that and so uh was using it was loving it and was all like fan and actually you know what no i hadn't streamed off of it um just yet so i was kind of like iffy about streaming off of it and luckily i didn't stream off of it because one of my friends is telling me that um and i think it was the same day i got it too but they was all like you need to uh switch out the the ram on there because i think i think i only had like 16 gigabytes of ram and i needed 32 in order to like stream and play video games and all that so anyways, um, went ahead, got the 32 gigabytes of RAM, plugged all that stuff up. I thought I had messed up my computer because it was, it wasn't like, um, like it, it wasn't acting right. It wasn't like, you know, turning on and, or, I mean, it was turning on, but it just wasn't, it wasn't acting normal. Okay. It wasn't acting like how it was when I very first got it. So I was all like, nah, bro, I, I can't, nah, man please don't. I'm like, please don't. I do not want to have to replace this computer and I just got it. I'm like, bro, no, come on, man. Don't do this to me. So anyways, I went ahead and, um, you know, I fixed it or I, I got it all set up and things. And then that's when it all started with streaming and all of that. And bro, I am telling you, it is honestly one of the best investments that I could have made. Now, the only downfall to it is that I don't have a top tier graphics card. So I'm probably am going to have to replace that soon. And I'm thinking of like, okay, let me just go ahead and give me a fancy smancy, uh, uh, whatchamacallit, processor. I'm going to most likely end up replacing this like whole computer and things because I'm like, I, I personally don't want to have something that's you know is gonna go out after a while like i want to keep this computer for a long time so if that means like i gotta switch parts out and all that stuff and you know like then so be it but i'm like this this is the last like gaming pc that i want to have right now because i got one occupying space in my room which is the friend i got the other side of that cyber power one and then i got so i'm like right where i got my new computer on the other side of my legs is the uh, old computer and stuff so and i should what i honestly should have just did was get parts and replace it but i'm like fam it's so much easier just going on best buy and then just getting a newer computer and stuff versus having to wait however long until they're like oh yeah and plus plus what i was hearing was like a lot of parts were being sold out all fast because people were buying them up and then trying to resell them for crazy amounts on on websites and things like there's a capture card. It's like a RTX 3080 or something like that. It's like one of the, like, the high-end, like, top-tier graphics cards to have right now. And there's people on websites trying to sell that mess for, like, $3,000. And I'm all like, no, you're crazy. I ain't spending no $3,000. And that's the one thing, that's the one thing that I just, I hate so much with that stuff, is that people really be trying to defend that. Like, nah, there is like, because I talked about it with sneakers and stuff, and people are all like, oh, supply and demand is supply and demand. I'm like, you're not supplying me with nothing, though. You're supplying me with a product that I could have very well bought off of the website. And you're not, you definitely ain't demanding anything out of me. I'm e you're either going to take whatever the price it was that was being paid for on the website, 
or otherwise I ain't um, getting it. But I'm saying, like, I don't like that reselling game, man. I'm like, that reselling game, because my thing is this, like, I, if, with me, people know me. People know I do things out of the kindness of my heart, so I'm like, I'm here to help. I ain't here to, you know, freaking, uh, like, go and jip people out of their, you know, stuff that they actually really need and things. And I'm like, nah, man, it's like, they ain't cool. Like, people know me, they know I don't roll like that. So I'm like, why would I support somebody that rolls like that? You know, it's like, it don't make no sense. So anyways, but yeah, people was like trying to charge all them crazy because I was looking at graphics cards because I was thinking of like upgrading mines. And so um, anyways, yeah, I'm looking there like people trying to charge crazy amounts for it. I'm like, well, forget it. I am going to be fooling with it and stuff. So anyways um so yeah i just left it alone but oh my god the video games bro i have been going through so many different video games it's crazy man it's honestly crazy it's crazy to like go and play warzone on a pc and stuff like i legit feel like one of my friends that be streaming like crazy amounts and stuff like there's one of my friends uh her name is blazing and she be posting, like, some of the most, like, mad crazy clips on, like, usually, like, y'all should go follow Blazing. Blazing's super chill and stuff, but, nah, she posting, like, mad crazy clips. And I be watching it, and I'm all like, okay, let me go ahead and do this. Meeting. No, it's actually fun fact. When I got my gaming PC, that's when I won my first game of uh, Warzone. I was playing, it was, like, one of them, like, secondary modes. It wasn't, like, the, the uh, uh, like, OG Battle Royale mode. But no, it was like one, it's like, re, no, not Rebirth, Resurge or something, I don't know. It's one of those modes that everybody's like been playing crazy amounts of and stuff. So anyways, um, yeah, I played that one and was all like, fam, oh, I got to um, stream now. And so yeah, streamed it, didn't go as planned, did, did, it did not go as planned as, um, I was like, man, I wish I would have recorded it or would have streamed it. Because I'm like, now I got to wait until the next time I'm playing Warzone. So I'm like, bro, that's, that's just going to be that's gonna be that, <laughs> I'm like, I'm like, I know that's gonna be stressful and stuff, but, oh my god, like, the amount of video games I've came across, like, bro, it's honestly, it's insane, just the variety of games that I just, like, unlocked for myself and stuff, and so, anyways, yeah, I've been playing a bunch of different games I bought off of, uh, Steam, because at one point, I was buying a crap ton of games off of Steam, like, I was, so, on my original Dell Inspiron uh, computer, which was not a gaming computer, that was it was like one of those computers that college kids get, and it's only good for like Word document and freaking you know notes. It is good for them little programs and stuff, and like maybe an old old video game, but it ain't gonna be uh, supporting because I got that computer at the time in like 2015 and stuff. So there's like a lot of like, there's like Daisy was kind of blowing up, freaking Seven Days to Die was blowing up, Rush was blowing up. It's like a bunch of different games that was blowing up at the time. And um, I even, you know, I was just like getting into those games and uh, well at the time and then not being able to play them because the computer I had was horrible. So now that I got me a good computer, I'm like now I'm able to play all these games. and st I mean, I always could, but it was like just now I got me like a good, good computer and stuff, not like some low end computer and things, but Anyway, so I had, uh, yeah, I was just been downloading a bunch of different games, buying a, a bunch of new different games, and then one game that I had came across where it made me get uh, another investment for my gaming PC is one of them steering wheel controllers. So the game that I've been playing a lot of on uh, Steam is uh, Assetto Corza Competizione, and it's like this like realistic, it ain't even a realistic simulator racing game. I'm like, if it is, I'm like, you guys made it a, a tad bit too realistic, okay? What you guys got going on in that game does not need to be happening every time I play it and stuff, so no, that game ain't even realistic. No, I, I say that because they have it where if you play practice mode on that game, your car does not spin out at all. Okay, if it does spin out, it's because you're a bad driver. In career mode, for some odd reason, when I'm playing it, car just be spinning out like crazy. And I'm like, fam, what is the problem? There's nothing wrong. I'm like, I don't get why the car keeps spinning. So I'm like, I am not really trying to fool with that game right now. Honestly, I'm just trying to wait for uh, the new F1 game to come out so I can play that and see how that goes. And hopefully it goes good. But yeah, I'm like, I ain't even trying to fool with the uh, um, uh, Assetto Corza right now. And I would like to play the uh, original Assetto Corza, but so the problem is, so there's a couple of problems with it. So when I uh, open up Streamlabs OBS and it doesn't recognize, so they'll have like a launcher open up for the game. 
And then they'll have, like, the game open up on a separate, like, program and stuff. So I'm sitting here trying to, like, uh, you know, record stream. And it's not even capturing it. And it won't capture it until the game comes up. And then it's, like, then it's just going to be at times where it's, like, it'll say, like, start a game. And then it'll go back to the game. And it'll keep going doing that. I'm, like, I ain't trying to have it where my streams are like that. So I'm, like, uh-uh. No, I, that ain't happening. So I ended up uh, just giving up on that game. Oh, and then my steering wheel uh, controller wasn't really, like, because I think it's an old game and so i i don't know i'm guessing it's maybe that but i'm like fam i played even newer games and it still was like my controller just was not working properly with that game and i'm all like no nah, because i played uh uh last year's f1 2021 uh, or yeah uh, f1 2021 and that was like fam like it just it was not working properly and i'm like man forget it i don't want to play the game no more so yeah, it, it's been, bro, it has been a hassle with video games, but I have been coming across a lot of different video games, like, there's the one game where I'm like, that game is pretty solid, uh, Planet Crafter, I've, bro, I've been freaking, like, uh, with Matt Damon when he was in The Martian on that game, then there's this other game that I've been playing of, freaking, it's like this cleaning simulator called Power Wash, and, um, yeah, I've been going crazy on that, then, yeah, I've been getting into a bunch of, uh, different other games, I'm like, man, this is, it's dope, to be able to have that, uh, Xbox, PlayStation, and all that stuff. So, I'm like, yeah, man, I, I freaking love having a gaming PC. Also, it, it's, like, it's easier to stream because all of my, like, everything that I need to look at is right there. So, prior before how I was streaming was that I would, so I would be, um, either stream off of my monitor because I bought, I, I already had a monitor. I had a monitor because I thought my, um, TV was messing up. But it turns out it was just a capture card that I have that was acting all weird and stuff. So anyways, um, bought this, uh, uh, monitor and then, uh, was like, so I was like, had that already down. But how I was recording before, but it was, I'd completely forgotten and I remembered and I was trying to improvise, but I was like, improvise, it ain't working. So anyways, all right, now I'm back now, I'm back now. But no, how I was uh, streaming before was that I would use my gaming laptop and then use like my, like sitting down and watching TV and stuff. So, yeah, it was, um, that was, like, it was somewhat of a hassle because I'm, like, having to, like, look at two different screens and stuff versus just having everything on one screen. But it does, um, I know eventually at some point in time I am going to have to go back to two screens because it messes up the resolution of video games that I play. So, I'm, I wish, that's what I honestly wish was that there was, like, because I know they have, like, them, like, stream deck things. And I was thinking, like, oh, okay, maybe it's, like, a touch screen or something. And I'm, like, and I would, I would just have where that thing was like plugged up and i'm like looking at my chat and i can like because i'm like i see where people they'll use their phone but i'm like i ain't trying to like mess up my internet and i'm like i know i could just turn off the data but i'm like then that means my uh stream is might be all slow and i'm not reading chat like right then and there so i'm like i wish it was just you know something where i'm all like i just wish i i think they do have it where you could get like a like a small monitor and just put it off on the side i'm like if that's the case i'm gonna do that i'm gonna get like this not a super small but like one that kind of like matches up with my uh um monitor and then uh yeah just overall like you know use that and things for a chat because i'm like just so i can like make the screen or make the resolution better for when i'm playing games but Man, I'm telling you, freaking streaming, it is, it's a hassle, fam. It is a, um, or like, just, or I guess like, you know, like, well, no, because that's what I did mostly get it for. I mostly got it for streaming. And man, it's a hassle. Like, I honestly, I knew I was going to get me a gaming PC at some point in time, but I was like, man, it is one of the biggest hassles I've ever had to do and get involved in and stuff. But it pays off, though. I freaking, I love it. I love, like, having to stay up middle of the night. You know, having to look through Steam, seeing what games I could be watching all these different videos, seeing what games I can play and stuff. So, yeah, I've came across some games. Um, games I'm currently playing right now is the Power Washing Simulator game. I, I'm kind of taking a break from Acelo Corza and stuff because Acelo Corza, after I freaking found out that crap with uh, uh, the freaking... Um, the practice mode and the career mode and i'm like i ain't even trying to fool with that game no more like i just don't get why why not just have it where it's the same like i don't get why they have like one thing instead of one way and another set up another way i'm like that would make no sense it ain't gonna have it where it's like oh if i'm driving on this like that's like in real life like if i'm like driving on the street and my car is gonna be fine but if i'm driving on an identical street it's just on another like road or another area then my car is sliding and spinning out and i'm like 
FM, same street. There ain't nothing different between these two streets. What is going on right now? What is why is this street cursed and this other one is perfectly fine? So yeah, I'm like, I, I just I'm I'm leaving that game alone right now. Then I found this one game called Caliber, and it's like this. It kind of like looks like one of the like old like Tom Clancy uh type games, and it's this like third person shooter game. And it's solid. It's actually pretty good. I like it and stuff. So, but yeah, I'm like, I'm currently looking for some other games. I'm thinking about getting into Call of Duty. I'm actually my, that's all I'm actually might end up doing is um downloading Overwatch. I bought Overwatch years ago. Uh, never played it on PC. So I'm like, nah, I might end up playing. Cause when does the new Overwatch um come out? Let me see something real quick. Uh, Overwatch two release date. It should be like highly wait. The highly anticipated game is finally available to the public first time. Is that a jump in public beta for one of the most anticipated games to use recently it goes live today? Twenty six players. Wait, so can you can I I know the game ain't gonna be free, but like is it playable? Hold on for a second. Cause if I could play Overwatch right oh um Overwatch two right now, I'm like, fam, forget one. I'm like how how do I okay Overwatch Overwatch two? Do I like download something like what what's the what's the problem? Join beta okay I I'll, I'll look into that when I um turn on my uh gaming computer and stuff but anyways and that being said I will talk to y'all later thank you guys for watching and or listening I appreciate each and every one of you guys for being here for the past 99 seasons. It's honestly been a um an enjoyable ride freaking do I'm, I'm gonna save like all the thank yous and stuff for the next episode uh for, for you know for the first episode of the 100 season and stuff. But um no I I just wanted to just take the time and to pre like thank each and every one of you guys for support my podcast. You know those that are if you aren't then hey you guys need to start supporting and stuff but anyways and that being said i'll talk to you guys later thank you guys for watching there and listening if you're viewing this on youtube make sure you like and subscribe if you're viewing this on podcast streaming service make sure you follow or subscribe however it's set up make sure you subscribe to all my 43 or 45 youtube channels follow me on twitter tiktok twitch and instagram at tmosboss and make sure you follow my facebook page at tmosboss fan page also if you're purchasing any tickets from SeatGeek, make sure you use my promo code tmosboss and then we'll knock 20 dollars off your first purchase and that being said i'll talk to you guys later thank you guys for watching and or listening and peace